Optimus Gen 3 has been redesigned by Tesla to become a homeworker robot that's easy to manufacture and affordable. With a 22-pound weight reduction, a simplified structure, and fewer components, the robot is now optimized for large-scale casting using the 50,000-ton Geiger Press. This massive machine, now operating in Texas, produces major body parts like the chest, back, and legs more quickly, precisely, and cost-effectively. How did the Geiger Press become the key to mass-producing humanoid robots? Before we begin, please help us reach 9,500 subscribers. It will be a huge motivation for us to continue bringing you great episodes about Tesla Bot, Tesla EVs, and the latest news. How does the 50,000-ton Giga Press influence the design of Optimus Gen 3? Tesla didn't redesign Optimus Gen 3 to make it prettier. It was redesigned to be mass-produced using ultra-large casting technology, specifically the 50,000-ton Giga Press. This is one of the most powerful alloy die-casting machines in the world, developed by Tesla with a singular goal, to take humanoid robots out of the lab and into large-scale industrial production at minimal cost. Earlier versions like Generation 1 and Generation 2 were still bulky, structurally complex, and mostly hand-assembled. Generation 3 marks a leap forward. Its weight has been reduced by 22 pounds, its modularity improved, its joints made more flexible, and most notably, components like the chest, back, and leg frames have been completely redesigned to support one-piece casting with the 50T Giga Press. This is not just a technological upgrade, it's a fundamental redesign of the robot from the ground up. The philosophy of design for manufacturing has been fully embraced. Every component must be shaped to allow for single-shot casting. No multi-part assemblies, no complex welding, no manual screwing. The Gen 3 Optimus frame now resembles a monolithic skeleton, hollow inside to house motors, batteries, and the central computer, yet still lightweight, strong, and precise enough for long-term operation. The Giga Press enables casting of metal parts with ultra-low tolerances less than 0.1 millimeters, ensuring near-perfect alignment between components, something traditional assembly methods struggle to achieve at high volume. The arrival of the 50,000-ton Giga Press forced the Optimus design team to abandon the old architecture with hundreds of discrete parts. Instead, the entire design had to conform to casting principles. Simplified cross-sections, stable alloy flow, no dead corners, easy mold release, and the integration of multiple functions into a single cast piece. For example, the chest of Optimus Gen 3, which houses the battery, central computer, and major sensors, is no longer a complex assembly of shells, brackets, and frames. It's now a solid, seamless alloy block cast by the Giga Press. This single piece serves as protection, structural support, and a mounting base for all core systems. Cutting the number of components by at least 30% and reducing assembly time by more than 50% compared to Gen 2. Thanks to the 50T Giga Press, Optimus is not just lighter, but also stronger. The 22-pound weight reduction lowers energy consumption, extending operating time to 6 to 8 hours per charge. At the same time, the increased structural rigidity from cast components allows the robot to move more stably and safely while performing complex tasks like lifting objects, climbing stairs, or bending to pick things up. But more importantly, these one-piece cast parts are ideal suited for robotic assembly, meaning robotic arms in the factory can install them autonomously without human labor. This marks the first step toward Elon Musk's larger goal, building a factory where robots build other robots without requiring thousands of human workers like traditional assembly lines. The significance of the 50T Giga Press goes beyond reducing weight and parts. It's the key enabler that allows Tesla to bring the cost of each robot below $20,000. That's a revolutionary figure compared to today's humanoid robots like Boston Dynamics Atlas, estimated over $150,000, or Agility Robotics Digit over $70,000. With the ability to cast hundreds of large parts per day, the Giga Press allows Tesla to drive per unit costs to a minimum. If the robot's body can be built from just two to three cast blocks instead of hundreds of smaller pieces, then labor costs, error rates, and inspection time all drop exponentially. In fact, designing for the Giga Press also simplifies maintenance. If part of Optimus's leg frame is damaged, 
Tesla can simply replace the entire cast piece within minutes, rather than disassembling every joint and metal bar. This simplicity in design translates to simplicity in repair, a critical factor for deploying robots at scale, from factories to homes. Once again, please help us reach 9,500 subscribers. This is important for us to stay motivated. Thank you. What role does GigaPress play in making Tesla bot affordable? The new design of Optimus Gen 3 is not just a technical improvement, but a core strategy for cost reduction. With the goal of bringing the robot's price below $20,000, Tesla had to do something no tech company has ever done, transform a complex humanoid robot into a low-cost industrial product, just as it once did with electric vehicles. And at the center of that cost-cutting strategy is the 50,000-ton Giga Press, a massive alloy casting machine that not only redefines how robots are made, but also drives production costs down to unprecedented levels. While the production cost of a typical humanoid robot like Boston Dynamics, Atlas, or Agility, Robotics Digit, ranges from $70,000 to over $150,000 due to complex structures and manual assembly, Optimus Gen 3 is designed to be faster, simpler, and drastically cheaper, thanks to its full adoption of one-piece cast manufacturing. Previously, Optimus had a structure made up of hundreds of small mechanical components, screws, subframes, connectors, brackets, sensor housings, many made of steel or high-end materials that are difficult to manufacture. Each part required multiple stages, cutting, welding, polishing, assembly, testing, and adjustment, all of which increased costs, lengthened production time, and made it difficult to assure consistency across robots. But with Gen 3, Tesla shifted toward a design philosophy focused on material minimization, part reduction, and functional integration, all to fully leverage the GigaPress 50T's alloy casting capability. When major sections of the robot, like the chest or legs, are cast as a single solid block, all the costs associated with internal assembly disappear instantly. No need for mechanical engineers to screw together every joint. No need for alignment checks on every connection. No need to fabricate and manage hundreds of individual parts. This is how Tesla slashes thousands of dollars off each robot simply by changing the way the frame is built. Moreover, labor cost, one of the most expensive factors in robot manufacturing, has been drastically reduced through automation. In traditional robot assembly lines, engineers are responsible for delicate tasks like installing arms, mounting motors, wiring electronics, calibrating sensors, and more. But Optimus Gen 3 is designed to be assembled by robots. Robotic arms can automatically pick, place, fasten, and inspect components no human hands required. As Elon Musk once stated, Optimus will be assembled by other Optimus robots in the factory. That's how we scale. The GigaPress sits at the beginning of that chain, casting parts that are then moved and assembled entirely by machines. This closed-loop production model cuts millions in operating costs every year. Cost savings aren't limited to production. The new design also reduces logistics and inventory costs. With fewer parts, Tesla needs to ship and store fewer components, lowering risks of delays, damage, and simplifying the supply chain. While rival robots may require sourcing hundreds of components from dozens of suppliers across multiple countries, Optimus needs only a few cast blocks and core electronic modules, all of which can be produced in-house at a single Giga factory. This provides long-term cost advantages, insulating Tesla from inflation, raw material price swings, and third-party delays. Optimus Gen 3 is also engineered for ultra-low maintenance costs. Thanks to its modular cast-molded body, Tesla can replace entire damaged sections within minutes rather than disassembling every tiny component. The low cost of replacement fast repair time and reduced error rate make the monthly operating cost of Optimus, whether in a factory or a household, significantly lower than any other humanoid robot. It's this combination of low upfront price and minimal maintenance that makes widespread deployment of humanoid robots truly feasible. Lastly, economies of scale play a decisive role. Tesla can sell robots near production cost because it expects to manufacture hundreds of thousands per year. This mirrors the Model 3 strategy 
as volume increases, average unit costs drop dramatically. The Geiger Press 50T helps Tesla achieve this with unmatched speed and precision. If each cast takes just a few minutes, then a single line can produce thousands of blocks per day, enough to supply tens of thousands of robots per month. How many Optimus units can Tesla build per month with the help of a 50,000-ton Giga Press? When Elon Musk announced the goal of producing 10,000 Optimus bots per month, equivalent to 120,000 robots per year, the tech world immediately realized that Tesla wasn't merely building a product, but laying the foundation for an entirely new economy, one powered by non-human labor. And the key to realizing that ambition doesn't lie solely in AI software, but in large-scale physical manufacturing, where the 50,000-ton Gigapress and Optimus's simplified casting-based design form a strategic duo. If in the early years Tesla struggled with bottlenecks in assembling the Model 3, then with Optimus, the company is taking the opposite approach, building massive production capacity first, and then popularizing the robot. With the Giga Press, Tesla can cast the main structural blocks of Optimus in just minutes, meaning a single production line can create hundreds of robot parts per day. Combined with a fully automated assembly system, already deployed in Tesla's factories for years, the Optimus production process could reach near-complete automation. More importantly, this process can be replicated globally, just like how Tesla expanded Giga Shanghai, Giga Berlin, and now Giga Mexico. A line built in Texas can be copied to China, India, or Europe, because the entire supply chain, casting machines, robotic arms, and robot design are already standardized. When a company can produce 10,000 humanoid robots per month, over 300 per day, it's no longer just technological R&D, it becomes a human labor replacement industry. With a target cost below $20,000 per unit, Tesla could deploy Optimus across its factories, logistics chains, and even into homes or service companies. A robotic worker can operate 16 hours a day, seven days a week, without breaks, wages, or strikes. And when Optimus is produced in the hundreds of thousands each year, robot adoption will move from experimental to dominant. Unlike other robotics companies that produce only a few hundred units per year for demonstration or specialized enterprise use, Tesla approaches the market like it did with the Model 3. Build robots the way cars are built, at the highest volume possible. And more importantly, at sufficient scale, Tesla not only reduces cost, but can also use robots to build other robots. Optimus Gen 3's modular design and simplified assembly allow its limbs, joints, circuits, and cast frames to be installed by other robotic arms. Elon Musk once said, Optimus will be built by other Optimus robots. That wasn't hyperbole. It's a clear strategy, a closed-loop production system where robots build the next generation of robots, enabling infinite replication. When manufacturing no longer depends on human labor, scaling becomes unlimited. The strategic implications of this are profound. First, it allows Tesla to expand its robotic workforce into multiple industries, manufacturing, warehousing, healthcare, hospitality, and more, at a speed no other company can match. Second, it shifts the global labor structure. Repetitive, dangerous, or tedious tasks can be entirely handed over to Optimus, while humans focus on creativity, management, and social interaction. Third, Tesla will gain an unmatched competitive edge, not just as an automaker, but as the world's largest producer of robotic labor. With such powerful manufacturing infrastructure, Tesla doesn't need to wait for the world to adopt robots. It will bring robots to the world. Every Giga Press Optimus production line becomes a replication machine that can be deployed in any country. And since robots don't require wages or holidays, regional labor costs become irrelevant. An Optimus built in the U.S. or India is the same, just like a silicon chip, independent of borders. This will trigger a global restructuring of labor and economics. Companies may favor using robots over relocating factories to low-wage regions. Mass production also unlocks mass customization. When Tesla can produce 100,000 Optimus units per year, 
it can offer multiple variants, industrial optimus for carrying loads and assembly, commercial optimus for reception and service, household optimus for cleaning and cooking, or even a minimalist version with limited functions for $10,000. The Giga Press is the physical foundation of this flexibility. Each version can be cast from the same machine, just by swapping molds. We appreciate your contributions and hope you will have the most relaxing feelings after watching this video. If you did, please hit the like button and join the Techno Creator family by subscribing to our channel. And don't miss out on any of our awesome videos by hitting the bell icon. We value your feedback and your time. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you soon. Until then, stay safe and have fun.